Hey guys, what's up? How y'all doing? I'm here to talk to you guys about the new episode of Dr. Stone, which is on which is on part 2 on episode 4, or Dr. Stone New World, you know, on episode 15, or the total number of episodes. This episode right here was actually pretty cool, so if anything else, let's just get this started. We have to it that our boy Moles decides to cause some trouble here and there, and Senku and the others decides to like him get some materials ready, such as the drone, and what's even worse, the gun, the gun weapon, you know? Which we all know how dangerous this weapon can be. We all know and understand how guns work, you know? Because those things is like pretty much one way how to kill you, and then making backup plans should Moles betray them. And we all know how dangerous Moles is, because he's the strongest man on the island. So, we have no choice but to have someone who's good at doing, like, um, knowing how to use a gun, and that guy is yo, is yo or you, you, ue, you, you know? Because he was a former policeman, policeman, you know? So, apparently him knowing how to fire a gun here and there was actually pretty impressive. Although, like, um, he does need to put in some practice and must not mess this up, because thing is, is like, um, it only it's only gonna get out get a little worse from here on out. We'll have to see. But that aside, um Yeah. Pretty much like um they prepare some clothing to lure out the enemy. Of course Moz is gonna help him out eventually. And then they end up having a drone getting ready to like um whatchamacallit, um um, to help out, and they end up unpetrifying some friends, you know, such as Ginro or Kinro. Kinro helping out, you know, he does understand the situation of what's hap what happened here and there, so he decides to do his best to help out and become the leader of the freaking group of warriors, you know, etc. As for creating a drone, you know, we have Rusei, who apparently is good at video games because his friend his friend taught him how to play because he could buy that off with money. You get the idea. Decides to fight. Decides to man control or control man man control or manhandle the freaking like um. The drone whatsoever. You get the idea. Anyways, um, pretty much like, um, this episode is just preparation of what's to come, you know? Facing off the enemy, getting the petrification weapon, and then, like, what else? Um, facing against Moz, who could highly, most likely betray them, and they have the gun weapon ready to shoot him out. But they are not going to kill him because they, it's not, like, their way of doing things. Not to mention, like, um... It would not make Ukyo very happy, you know? He pretty much agrees and helps Senkus out because if you could keep your hands clean, that's all I ask. Then we could get things going, you know? That kind of thing. You get the idea. And of course, at the very end of the day, they get they are met with the army and so forth and get ready to go into action. Which apparently is going to be here on out risky considering that the enemy outnumbers them, not to mention outmuscles them because... In terms of combat, offense, and all that, it's pretty much a dead, a dead like um, dead game over draw whatsoever. You know, of course, Moz, like I said, is only temporarily helping them for the time being when it presents itself. For now, when the time goes, he will possibly or most likely going to betray them and kill them all because that's just how strong he is. You know, you get the idea. So, we'll see how this goes out as for Ibarra. He does have some doubts of what's going to happen, you know, because that's just who he is, and he knows something is wrong. So, yeah, we don't know how that's going to turn out, but it's not going to be very pretty. So, until then, people, I'll see you guys in the next video. So, I'm out for Zero. Have a good day. I'll see you guys next time, all right? Peace out. Bye-bye. Toot-toot-toot!